We're going to be discussing the dihydropyridines. So the structure we have here is um, for the amlodipine. And um, so let's start uh, with first the R1. So R1, all right, so R1 should be, uh, as you guys see, R1 is um, it's right here, and uh, it should be unsubstituted. Now, uh, in, in case it have uh, substitution, it should not be bulky, and it should be easily removable, okay? So we started with R1, and uh, it's either, again, unsubstituted. If there's a substitution, it should be easily removable. Now, mostly the R1 and the R2, those two, they should be... Um, uh, they should be smaller alkyl groups. If we're gonna replace the R2 with a basic amino, um, with with a basic amino ethyl ether chain, is gonna result in a more potent. Okay. Now the replacement um, of the R2, so we're still here. Replacement of the R2 with uh, an aryl group, it loses activity. So instead here if we change this and we added an arrow group this is gonna uh, lead to loss of activity okay now if we're gonna replace the R2 with a basic amino um, ethyl ether chain this is gonna have give us a potent drug now the eloxy carpineal group gives more optimal activity on the R3 and the R5 all right so here we have the R3 and we have the R5 and the loxycarpinyl group gives more optimum activity of the substitution. Variation in the chain length or the branching at the alkyl components of the ester groups will decrease the activity. Okay? So if uh if we're going to if we're going to manipulate the length all right or uh, the branching, this is going to lead to decrease of the activity. Now, when we talk about the the substitution here, so this it should be uh, a phenyl ring. All right. If it's monosubstituted, the ortho substitution will make the product higher in activity versus other substitution. Okay, we added this ring, and we wanted to add uh, wanted to add some branching to it, and we added the Cl, for example. Now Cl here is ortho, so this is going to be active or more active. Okay, now. If if I add a Cl here, for example, this is going to be less active. If I add something here, for example, well, same thing. This is going to be this. 